I know Mick Jagger won't be here tonight. He's going to have to stay in England. But I'd like to see us in the Coliseum and him Lemley Stadium because he's always been chicken shit to get on stage with the Beach Boys. Just ask Mick Jagger. He'll tell you all about me. Anyway. You're Mr. Budget Guy? Well, no. I'm just, you you know, coupons? Uh, I'm just a brat. That's all, you know. We're just mooching on everyone. Yeah, that's it. Me. That's... Yeah. What does Mick say about you? If Mick were here, what would he say? Um, we'd probably start a fight, you know. Probably. Like no, it's not that. I think he, uh, we respect each other, but we there's a certain built-in, you know, uh, macho, uh, you know, cavalier disregard for each other, you know, affected pose, posers. Sounds like jealousy to me. No, not jealousy. No, you jealous. think he's jealous of me? Why? Because I sing better, get more chicks. Exactly. What? Yeah. Well, he's got to stop hanging out with that Jerry Hall. You know, she beats him up. She's bigger than he is. You know. <laughs> she is. God, her legs go all the way to John to, to Tiananmen Square and back. <laughs> so, what is this interview for, anyway? Even Mick Jagger liked I Get Around. You realize that? The significance of that statement? The global impact? That's because I sing the lead on it. That's but, which goes to show you, somewhere deep down, there must be some good in, in Mick Jagger. <laughs> David Bowie says it was. <laughs> I love kicking this I like getting Mick Jagger, you know what I mean? No, no, he's... And a lot of guys, a lot of people out there are going, who? Mm -hmm. <laughs> this skinny big lip guy from England runs around the stage trying to be black. You know? <laughs> he didn't give me no satisfaction, but like I said, he gave David Gore some money. Who couldn't resist? I had to do it. I had to do it. What I, I, I said that Mick Jagger was chicken shit to get on stage with the Beach Boys. And it's true, and I meant every word of it. 